When selecting members for your safety committee, there are several aspects to consider. Look for individuals with a positive attitude and influence that can improve your workplace. It's important for them to be familiar with the hazards, personal protective equipment, and procedures that relate to your workplace. They should also be well aware of any previous workplace injuries and illnesses that have happened. Ensure they are knowledgeable about the organization's workflow, systems, and products. It's also important for them to have the ability to assess situations that require corrective action and make useful recommendations. Your committee members should be trained in conducting safety and health inspections and handling personnel situations. Remember that your safety committee must have the same number of members selected by the employer and by employees. So for example, if you had a committee consisting of four members, two would be chosen by the employer and the other two would be picked by the employees. Now there is an exception to this, and that's when the entire committee agrees there can be a majority of employee selected members. Whichever the case, your committee cannot be a majority of employer selected members. Employees have the option to choose to be represented by another employee or a supervisor. For more information, please look at our online course on safety committees, available by clicking on the resource page below.